<coughs> Welcome to an Untitled Review. Um, this one's, you know, if you've been watching Untitled for a little while, you, you know I tend to do, you know, se semi-in-depth stuff. Um, you know, but basically I'm working on a couple of long-form videos at the moment, you know, where I really, really get into it. Um, so th this video and probably the next video is really just like a warm-up video for the day. Because cause the next ones are going to be pretty hefty, uh, you know. But this one, this one's going to be pretty, pretty, pretty rapid. Um, you know, look, I got, I got some shit to do. Uh, yeah, because the next review, it, the, the review I'm going to do after these reviews is uh, in depth. Um, it's going to take fucking weeks. But this, this review that I'm doing now is actually going to be a lot faster. Um, all right, and and again, you know, after the bout of box wine poisoning, which is going to be one of those long long reviews, uh, you know, there's there's a there's a lot going on. I'm just going to move this camera over here. It's shitting me off. Like it feels like it's on the wrong side of me. Here we go. That that's that's probably worse. Um, yeah, look, I, I don't know, man. Okay, so we're going to be reviewing uh, made in Australia, Thorny Devil, Apple and Pink Guava Cider. It claims uh, to be devilishly good, or that may just be part of the product name. It is difficult to say. No, this is going back over here. Uh, it feels like it's on the wrong side. Okay. Uh, it, it either claims to be devilishly good, or, or that's part of the product name. It's um, difficult to say. Uh, it claims to be clean, refreshing, crisp, a clear... Oh, sorry. A clean, crisp, and refreshing apple cider infused with pink guava. The perfect marriage. Okay. Brewed by Thorny Devil Brewing Company. Uh, 185 Clifton Down Syndrome. Road, uh, Mandurah, Western Australia, 6211. Purchase at thornydevil.beer, www.thornydevil.beer, at thornydevil.beer. Oh, there's no dot there, but it's all right. It's all right. Drink responsibly, store refrigerated, and consume fresh. How the fuck am I supposed to consume it fresh? They're asking too much here. This is, this is probably one of those get out of jail free fuck you things they've got going on. Oh, sorry. Uh, it, it gave you AIDS. Oh, did you did you consume it fresh? Oh, no. You consumed it after it made it to you. Fucking after sitting in a warehouse for three years. Well, governor, why don't you go fuck yourself? Cunts. Standard drinks 2.3, uh, apparently vegan or vegetarian or whatever that says, uh, 10 cent possible refund, I'm still unclear as to how to get my 10 cent possible refund, pregnancy warning, alcohol can cause lifelong harm to your baby, oh fuck, you know, I, I wasn't expecting this to happen, it's a fucking barcode, you know we love barcodes, like, I don't know if you're, like, like from the very early days of the channel, you know, we've been... We've been using this as a loophole to call ourselves uh, an educational channel for kids. And it's mainly because of these barcode things where we read the numbers while looking at them, thus teaching your children uh, numbers. 93582370017. See, now it's educational. Hey, 8%. Nice. All right, let's uh, do this thing. Look, it's got a good sound to it. I do enjoy that. The smell is bad. Yeah, the smell is bad, but the sound is good. All right, let's do a pour shot here. Oh, fuck, it's foaming up. It's foaming up. Did I? Oh, shit, I stopped just in time. Fucking nice. All right, so this is a high foam beverage. I'm not really useful. Wait, what does this claim to be again? Cider, okay, it claims to be cider. It smells like a beer. I can smell like hops and shit. This is fucked, mate. It's fucked. You're fucked. Oh my god, it smells. It smells like Heineken or some shit. The fuck? Alright, hold on. Uh, it smells bad, guys. Like. And I say, guys, like. There's been some stuff in the comment section. Sorry, YouTube tells me 100% of my viewers are male still. I, I checked. 100%. All time, uh, which is actually really hard to believe, but uh, yeah, sorry to my non-male listeners out there. Uh, YouTube has spoken. Um, fuck. All right, 
My god, I don't want to drink this. It smells so goddamn bad. Oh my god, it tastes like... It tastes like if you got, like, a Heineken. And you know how, like, with... Oh. Oh. God damn it. You know, with, like, uh, various uh, Mexican-themed beers, you'll put, like, a lime or something in there, and it tastes... It tastes like you just dumped a shitload of lime juice in, in your Heineken. Um... I wouldn't recommend it, but... Oh, no, it's going to foam up again. Oh, it's less foamy now. That's the... Ah, stop it. You're making it hard to finish this review. All right. So, uh... Okay, it's, it's coming clear. It's, um... Bright orange. Oh, my God. It smells so fucking bad. All right, so... If you can sort of, like... <coughs> Just scull it as fast as possible. Don't really... Don't taste it or anything. I just realised I'm not wearing shoes in the angle of this. Fuckers may have gotten to look at my feet for free. Spilled a bit. That's good. Alright. Alright, so this is the last... Oh my god, that looks bad and it tastes bad. God damn it. Alright, here we go. Oh, oh, fuck. Oh. I fucked up and I tasted it going down. Oh. I drank it. Alright, this has been a review for uh, uh, Thorny Devil Made in Australia Apple and Pink Guava Cider Devilishly Good. I would say it is uh, devilishly not good. Fucking owned. Uh, 2.3 out of 10.